Hi, today I'm going to share Chinese hot pot with you. Right here we have a yin and yang hot pot. And you'll see that there's two compartments. One side is just plain chicken broth, and the other side is a hot and sour chicken broth. We made the hot and sour chicken broth using vinegar. This is balsamic vinegar, two tablespoons, and um, a tablespoon of crushed red pepper. So we'll let that heat up, and I'll talk a little bit about the ingredients. Uh, what we have for ingredients, uh, we, we have scallops. These are sea scallops that I've sliced in half so that they're very thin. We have Maine shrimp, which is a cold water shrimp, which is quite tender and they're very nice and sweet. We have fresh Chinese noodles, haddock. We have some vegetables. And we also have some shaved steak, which is very thinly cut. We also have bean sprouts and we have some salmon as well. Now there are a couple different ways that you can cook Chinese hot pot. One way is that you can cook it one ingredient at a time, kind of like fondue. So if I wanted some steak, what I would do is I would take the steak and I would just place it in here. And remember this is very hot, so all I have to do is swish this around a couple times. That's cooked because it's so thinly sliced. And I have some hoisin sauce here, and it's homemade. And the way you make this is two parts of ketchup and one part of soy sauce. You may not know it, but ketchup is actually invented in China. So we'll just dip that in. And that's quite good. Now the other way you can do Chinese hot pot is everyone has a bowl of rice and what you can do is you can place your ingredients into the soup. Now the noodles take the longest to cook so we'll put the noodles in first and then we'll put in some shrimp. There we go. So this would be you know, for for my uh, dish, put in some haddock as well, and some salmon. And scallops cook the cook the fastest, so we're going to put those in last. We'll put in some vegetables. I don't want to overcook my vegetables, so we'll put those in. We have some broccoli, some onions, some sweet red peppers snow peas, there we go, and as I said the last thing we'll put in will be some scallops. So we'll put those right in, just like that. And then what you have is you have this wire basket, and that's really only in there for a minute or so. And remember, we've put the noodles in first, so they've been cooking a little bit longer. And this is boiling. So what we'll do is we use the basket, and we can just pull out our ingredients, just like that. And that cooks very quickly, again, because that's very hot broth. Oh, the other thing that is in here that I didn't talk about earlier is I have cloud ears. And cloud ears are a type of uh, dried fungus. Um, and I had put those in about 15 minutes earlier so that they would be able to soften up in the broth. So there you have it. Chinese hot pot, the yin and the yang. We'll see you next time.